Do you know the captivating tale of the seventh voyage of Sinbad, the 1958 movie that brought legendary creatures to life on the silver screen? Today, we delve into lesser known facts and memorable characters of this classic adventure. One question that might pique your curiosity, are there any lesser known facts or anecdotes about this movie that fascinate you? The film boasts remarkable stop motion effects by the renowned Ray Harryhausen, giving birth to the iconic Cyclops and fire-breathing dragon. But what about the secrets behind the scenes that made these fantastical creatures a reality? Out of the many roles in this movie, which one was your favorite? Was it the valiant Sinbad, the daring Princess Parisa, or perhaps one of the mesmerizing monsters that challenged them on their epic journey? Share your preference with us in the comments below, we'd love to hear your thoughts and memories. Now, let's set sail into the world of the seventh voyage of Sinbad, exploring its enchanting secrets and memorable characters. What's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this movie? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad, a 1958 classic fantasy film directed by Nathan Duran, follows the legendary sailor Sinbad on a daring adventure. Originating from the tales of One Thousand and One Nights, the story revolves around Sinbad's quest to rescue a princess, who has been reduced to miniature size by an evil sorcerer. This groundbreaking movie boasts iconic characters such as Sinbad, the valiant hero, and various mythological creatures, including the iconic Cyclops and the fire-breathing dragon. What sets this film apart is its pioneering use of stop-motion animation by the legendary Ray Harryhausen, which brings these fantastical creatures to life in a way that was unprecedented for its time. The seventh voyage of Sinbad left an indelible mark on popular culture, influencing subsequent fantasy films, and showcasing the enduring appeal of epic adventures and mythical beasts on the silver screen. It remains a cherished classic that continues to captivate audiences with its timeless charm and imaginative storytelling. The seventh voyage of Sinbad holds a special place in film history. One interesting fact about this movie is that the producer, Charles H. Schneer, considered it to be Bernard Herrmann's best work among the films he collaborated on with Ray Harryhausen. Herrmann, the renowned composer, crafted a unique set of orchestral colors for this film, as he did for others like The Three Worlds of Gulliver, Mysterious Island, and Jason, and The Argonauts. His exceptional musical contributions added depth to the movie's magic and adventure. This classic film also made it to the American Film Institute's list of 400 movies nominated for the top 100 most heart-pounding American movies in 2001. It's a testament to the enduring excitement and thrill this film continues to provide to its viewers. Moreover, the film's location, with a stone brook flowing with red wine, is the same place in Spain where the crew in Mysterious Island discovers a brook with fresh water. This interesting connection between the two films showcases the creativity of the filmmakers and the reuse of captivating locations. In conclusion, The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad is not just a legendary fantasy film, but also a testament to the exceptional work of Bernard Herrmann, its recognition on AFI's list, and the unique use of filming locations. It continues to be a beloved classic in the world of cinema. The 1958 movie The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad introduced a groundbreaking animation technique called Dynamation. It was a marketing strategy to distinguish it from traditional cartoon animation and gain popularity as the new miracle of the screen. This innovative approach set the film apart and paved the way for future cinematic creations like The Three Worlds of Gulliver and Mysterious Island, which used variations of the same technique. The seventh voyage of Sinbad remains a testament to the creativity and ingenuity of its producers, Charles H. Schneer and Ray Harryhausen, in bringing fantastical worlds to life on the silver screen. This marks a significant milestone in the history of film technology. Ray Harryhausen's interests shifted from modern-day sci-fi monster thrillers to fantasy adventures set in a romantic past after making 20 million miles to Earth in 1957. This transition marked a significant shift in his career. The seventh voyage of Sinbad was one of the notable results of this change, featuring groundbreaking animation techniques and introducing dynamation. This innovative approach set the film apart from traditional cartoon animation, earning it the nickname The New Miracle of the Screen. 
It paved the way for future cinematic creations like The Three Worlds of Gulliver and Mysterious Island, which also utilized variations of the same technique. Ray Harryhausen's move to fantasy adventures and the development of Dynamation technology marked a significant milestone in the history of film technology, providing a platform for the creation of fantastical worlds on the silver screen. The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad, the 1958 classic fantasy film, was a groundbreaking production in several ways. One of its notable achievements was being the first feature to fully utilize stop-motion animation effects in color. This marked a significant leap in the technology of the time, allowing the film to bring its fantastical creatures to life with vibrant and captivating visuals. This achievement set a precedent for future films that would use similar techniques to create mesmerizing worlds on the silver screen. Furthermore, the movie's production had its share of challenges. During the filming, lead actor Kerwin Matthews fell seriously ill with a 107-degree fever, leaving only one scene to shoot. Despite his illness, he agreed to complete the scene where Sinbad navigates his ship through a storm, a pivotal moment in the film. This dedication to the project showcased the commitment of the cast and crew to bring this epic adventure to life. Lastly, the film's choice of location added to its charm. Saw Conca Beach in Spain, with its steep embankments, jagged boulders, and exotic trees, was a favorite locale for producer Charles H. Schneer's fantasy films. This unique location not only appeared in The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad, but also featured prominently in other films like The Three Worlds of Gulliver and Mysterious Island. The reuse of this captivating location highlighted the creativity and resourcefulness of the filmmakers. In summary, The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad from 1958 was a pioneer in utilizing color stop-motion animation, overcame production challenges, and made creative use of picturesque filming locations. These elements contributed to the film's enduring legacy in the world of cinema. The film The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad from 1958 had a Cyclops model that Ray Harryhausen built using the skeletal armature of the monster from 20 million miles to Earth, made the previous year. Ironically, he initially conceived of the Venusian monster as a Cyclops. This interesting fact about the film's special effects showcases the creative and innovative approach taken by the filmmakers. Ray Harryhausen's ability to repurpose and adapt his creations added to the film's unique charm. The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad is a testament to the ingenuity of its creators in the world of cinematic special effects. As we sail away from the enchanting world of The Seventh Voyage of Sinbad, I invite you to embark on a journey of reflection. This timeless 1958 classic has left an indelible mark on the hearts of countless adventurers like yourself. The captivating tale of Sinbad's quest to rescue Princess Parasa and his encounters with mythical creatures has transcended generations, weaving a tapestry of wonder, nostalgia, and fantasy. Now, it's your turn to share your cherished memories and thoughts about this cinematic gem. Did you first experience the magic of the seventh voyage of Sinbad? As a child, marveling at the wondrous creatures brought to life by Ray Harryhausen's stop-motion mastery, or perhaps you were captivated by the fearless spirit of Sinbad and the beauty of the Arabian Nights setting. Whether it's the thrilling battles with Cyclops or the enchanting dance of the genie, there's a moment that has touched your heart. This movie, with its blend of adventure, romance, and mythical wonder, has a unique place in the hearts of film enthusiasts. Share your stories, your favorite scenes, and your connection to this cinematic masterpiece. Let's celebrate the magic it has brought into our lives and the endless adventures it has inspired. Thank you for taking this voyage with us through the world of the seventh voyage of Sinbad. Your time and interest are greatly appreciated as we continue to explore the rich tapestry of film history together. Until our next cinematic adventure, stay curious and keep those memories alive.